darkness and shadow. A curse spreads its bat-like wings over the land. The flow of life has been corrupted, stained by a malevolent god. The curtain rises on a new stage. Velsar, where shadows shroud all, covered by infinite rivers of blood. It is a land of claws, fangs, and strife, created by the Lord of Darkness. But the Lord sleeps, and his realm is rife with conspirators who would steal his throne. Dragon newts, vengeful souls, yokai, werewolves, vampires. These beasts spend their every waking hour locked in conflict. Fang against fang, claw against claw. Who shall wear the crown in the end? Will it be the meek? He once sought vengeance for his kind, but has now lost his purpose. But whether he is doomed eternally for failure, none can foresee. Will it be the bitter? He longs for the past and resents the present. But what his future will hold, none can fathom. Will it be the hollow? He has no memories, and yet is a master of the blade. But for whom he fights, none can tell. Will it be the lost? She quests for her mother, following a trail of whispered words. But where the path will lead her, none can see. These lives will join intersect, but will they be enough to overcome the heavy grasp of fate? A moot question. Mortals cannot overthrow a god. You are weak and an utter disappointment. How you managed to make it here, I sure don't know. I was hoping for someone worthy. Indeed, I was hoping for my next vessel. So this is the Lord of Darkness. Lord? No. I am a god. And you all are sheep in my fold. Now I will keep you as long as there's any profit in it. you lose your value to me, ye shall be led to the slaughter. They stretch forth their hands, but cannot grasp victory. They strive with all their strength, but cannot defy fate. Claws and fangs break and shatter, before fading into darkness. The ending of our newest tale is as of yet Unwritten. The ones who'll take down the Lord of Darkness and seize the throne will be us, the werewolves! You really think dogs can rule? Velsar belongs to us! Ha! Each and every one of you is nothing but prey for the Dragon Newts! You sure can bark, but you can't bite. The darkness of night is only the beginning. The rivers of blood. The scent of iron in the air. Velsar. Its history is one of endless war, an ocean of tears, and landfills of decapitated heads. A world where justice and ideals extinguish. Oh, how beautiful. Bones seized and broken. Bodies mutilated, fur stripped. 
screeching, sliced and shattered. Each claims justice, but tyranny reigns supreme. Truly a delight. Truly a thrill. The true essence of life, don't you think? I do not understand. You truly lack elegance, like a blade disdain of death, unknowing the beauty of battle. Kagero, truly a fitting name. You are not but a mirage, devoid of feeling, of passion. The same can be said for yours, Kikage. You are the dark side of the moon, the beauty and mystery. Your words are not yet cruel, the reason why you are weak. So your will has not changed? We must decide who is correct. We must commit. A sword never unsheathed is but a stick. <sighs> a drawn sword is but cold steel, neither good nor evil. Your presence is needed here. Vanish. Your defeat is fate. For your duty forgotten. And the path you walk gone astray. Thus, you must fall! strange. I feel lightheaded. Moreover. For what reason am I surrounded? We've got you now, you indiscriminate killer! How dare you murder our kin for no good reason! You disgust me! Give yourself up and accept your punishment! Murder? found five bodies with slashed backs and torsos! You're the only one around here with the blade capable of these acts. You're as good as guilty. There's no question. I killed? My apologies. I cannot remember. What? You can't remember? Is that your plan? To feign innocence? No. I truly cannot remember. Not a single thing. I seem to not have memories. Therefore, I remember nothing. The hell? Is this some sick game for you? That jog your memory well enough? Better luck in your next life, you monster. <gasps> it, it, it can't be. What the hell? I thank you for your kindness. However, it appears that blow did not clear the fog in my head. You, you should be pulverized. How the hell are you not dead? What kind of monster are we up against? Mercy tempered your last blow, but you may try again with all your strength. With pleasure! It's your funeral, punk! Get him, boys! Yeah! You picked the wrong crowd to mess with! Surround him! Ah. 
I can't. Go on. Uh. Just what the hell are you? What am I, you ask? The fog in my head is clear to some degree. To answer your question. You truly lack elegance. Like a blade disdain of death, unknowing the beauty of battle. Kagero, truly a fitting name. You are not but a mirage, devoid of feeling, of passion. My name is likely Kagero. Kagero, you say? Strange name. What kind of infuriating trick did you use? We practically hit you a dozen times over. A fair point. However, it is true that I am still standing. If hits and blows cannot calm your fury, perhaps a walk might do. My apologies for any inconvenience caused. What the hell are you talking about? You think this is something you can just walk away from? Please, let me through. Looks like you're not getting it. No one's letting you off the hook, murderer. If pleads of mercy worked, then Velsar wouldn't be a bloodbath. Either you put up a fight or you shut up and die. You might be tough, but you don't impress us. How about we tie him up and sink him into the depths? A pity. Look at him shaking in his pants. He's just scared of us. Frightened, yes. I do not wish to kill. However, if you choose to impede my path, I will have no choice but to exercise my abilities. Awoken under the shroud of night, surrounded by the roar of battle. All else remains uncertain. I may have forgotten since, but I cannot fall here. I shall regain my memory, and if any souls fell by my hand, I will offer you my neck. Enough of this tedious chatter! Give us your neck now! cannot sway you, then my blade will. For I walk the righteous path. Let us battle. I'm sorry.
की क्या कहे I must find him. Then I. You look troubled. Are you lost? You are. Or perhaps you've lost something. Shall I lend a hand? Skikake. Why the long face? Surprised that we'd meet so soon? Do not think it a mere coincidence, Kagero. Just as you are seeking me, I have been seeking you. As I thought, you know about me. Sure, I do. I know everything about you. You're a monster, one that strikes down innocent passers-by. Spacing out. <laughs> Unfortunate. I had hoped we'd settle the score at long last. But same as ever, you understand nothing about yourself. How soft, how kind, how depressing to see. As always, I see. I've lost my memories. You what? Please tell me, who am I? Uh huh. Is that so? Guess I've got them. What are you? What do I mean? Oh, you. Oh, absolutely agitating. Why must you speak through violence? I do not wish to fight. <laughs> you don't wish to fight? Even without memories, even without a clue about yourself, you continue to spout out the same nonsense! Whatever do you mean, you and I... Words are unnecessary. All we need is a clash of metal, sword against sword. <sighs> forever the coward, forever the fool. Just being around you pains me. But battle is inevitable. The first raindrop has already fallen. Soon, a storm will follow. Shall cut you down. Cut 
me down? What a joke! Allow me to remind you of one important fact. You will never prevail against me! Sluggish fool! Are you still half asleep? Focus! Unleash yourself! Elegant. I can't stand looking at you. <laughs> Do you know, not having the burdens of your past can be quite freeing. I was the same after all. Did you lose your past as well? Oh, yes. Got them back soon after making a few corpses, though. <sighs> We found five bodies with slashed backs and torsos! You're the only one around here with the blade capable of these acts. You're as good as guilty. There's no question. That was you. Depends on who you ask, doesn't it? <sighs> you don't get it? Well, I suppose you wouldn't! <sighs> This is pointless. You... What are you to me? Are you my enemy? Or... What am I? What a stale question. <clears throat> I considered finishing you off and ending everything, but this has been far more... boring than I had hoped. I'd get no satisfaction from killing you as you are now. So go and get your memories. I do not know how. No problem. I have the perfect medicine for shaking you out of your pathetic days. It shattered your body and your will once before. Now perhaps it can restore some motivation in you. Survive and come find me. For my sword art is your purpose, your goal, and your gravestone. <sighs> Art of Decay. Fool. of time. Twice I have shown you this technique, but for as long as you remain the way you are, it doesn't matter if it's the hundredth time, you will not prevail. Such a shame. Here I thought we might finally duel to the death. I can only wait so long. Next time, you'd better make sure those abilities blossom.
No. No. No, I will not. Slaughter them. It's what you were created for. It's your purpose. Stop. Please. Kill. Stop. Slaughter. Stop it. Kill, 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 kill! Stop it! <sighs> He held back. It shattered your body and your will once before. Now perhaps it can restore some motivation in you. Survive and come find me, for my sword art is your purpose, your goal, and your gravestone. Art of Decay. I can smell it. It must be you. We'll make you pay. your time, gentlemen. Huh? That's the name, Skikage. Let me start again. Have you seen a man carrying a sword like mine? What are you talking about? Surely if anyone knows anything about those incidents, it'd be you. He did the same to me. I stood no chance against him. You all must avoid him at all cost. Only death awaits those who encounter him. I wish for you to convey this to as many people as possible. What are you talking about? Who cares? Let's shut him up. <sighs> Sorry, we don't have any time for nonsense. This isn't a game, you know. You killed our clan members! We want vengeance! <sighs> You leave me no choice, for I must hurry on. More lives are slain as we speak. For 
I walk the righteous path. Let us battle. This message. Avoid the man carrying a sword. <sighs> Shut your mouth! What the hell are you? The yokai, the werewolves? You kill all without discrimination. Because of you, everyone's pissed off. <sighs> so, you enjoy killing, is that it? You won't last long here in Velsar. You may not believe me. However, the murders of your kind is not my doing. The man you seek is Kikage. I am also in pursuit of him. I do not wish to see any more people fall victim to his blade. However, if cutting you down and forcing my way through ensures the lives of many more... Sorry to interrupt, but I'll need you to stop right there. These are my clan members. Great, sir! I apologize. This jerk just... Enough. Off with you. Yes! Yes, sir! <sighs> you didn't chase after them. Thank you. I did not want to hurt them. You struck to kill. Why my claws are still numb. There was no other choice I could have taken. So I overheard what you had to say, and you claim that you weren't involved in the incidents. That is true. It's hard to believe you when you are the only one around these parts with that strange attire and sword. Precisely why I had no other choice but to draw my sword. I understand it may be illogical. However, it is the truth. Hmm. Yes. It doesn't seem like you're lying. You will believe me? Well, I don't know if I'd go that far. You do reek of blood, you know. <sighs> That's how we all tracked you down. We followed the stench. We've got you now, you indiscriminate killer! How dare you murder our kin for no good reason! Just as you are seeking me, I have been seeking you. I can smell it. It must be you. <sighs> but as long as there is no solid proof, I can't pass judgment on you. That wouldn't be justice. Innocent until proven guilty, as they say. You have my gratitude. Please pardon me. It appears you are well trusted about here. Would you happen to know the details? About what? About the murders, techniques used, or the intention. I've seen the bodies. It was a gruesome sight. Horizontal lines carved into their back and chest. And that's not all. I even saw bodies missing their arm. Their arm? Indeed. Left or right, but always one arm. Hmm. Those bodies were cut while they were still alive, from both the front and behind. It had to have used magic. There's no other explanation. Oh, and there's one more thing. It isn't directly related to the bodies, and I can't say that I really understand it. I would like to hear it. Please. The corpses were stretched out on flagstone. The stones nearest them had strange markings etched into them. Not sure if the information will prove useful to you, but there it is. Thank you. That may have provided me some clues. No need to thank me. I still haven't cleared you from all suspicion. Take care of it before the day's through. And if you fail to do this, 
It doesn't matter if you're telling the truth or not. I will crush you. I understand. I promise you. Good. And what do you intend to do about him? About this... Skikage? What to do? What to do? That isn't a very good answer. Oh well. Just do what you have to do. Skikage. Kagero. Good. And what do you intend to do about him? About this... Skikage? What to do? What to do? to stop Skikage. A blade is like water. Not good warm. It must be cold. A blade is like water. It is meant to flow to be swung. A blade is like water. A taste of it and flowers of blood will bloom. Well now, shall we chat a little about us? We're a type of yokai. I suppose vengeful souls is an easy way to put it. A demonic sword which is killed and bathed in the blood of many. Through time, generation after generation, consciousness of its own emerged. That's us. In short, we were born to water the fires of this world. Joy, pride, the passions of living. All life experiences them. We are the water that smothers those desires. To kill. And kill. And kill. During the time I awoke, Valsar was mired in violence, an age of war. Today, everyone has gone soft, only pretending to wait for the chance to strike. Open warfare is a thing of the past. Ah, the past. The things were great back then. I cut and stabbed, and not a complaint in the world. Except this fool. Kagero, detestable, and a lost cause. I loathe how he ruins each and every little thing. We must not murder. We must not take lives. How foolish. A pathetic joke. I am a blade. To cut and kill is my purpose. We argued and fought time and time again. Sometimes he wins, other times I win. The score was tied. He is the bane of my existence, truly. But the days where I won were undeniably the best. I can remember them so well. Stop! Please stop! I believe you are mistaken. This isn't something that can be halted. I cut the werewolf down as he fled. I'm begging you. I have a family. You do now. Don't worry. I'll find them next and bring you all together in the end. I killed the dragon newt as he begged. You. You're a yokai, aren't you? How can you betray us like this? Whoever said we were allies? At least I never did. 
Then I turned my back on the yokai. Ah, it felt so liberating. But the days for Kagerowan were a true low point. Utterly depressing. Being defeated was depressing. Being cut down was depressing. Worst of all, though, being sheathed with no purpose, completely devoid of joy and pleasure. Kagero, why are you always so composed, so calm? It is abnormal. It is unusual. How loathsome. The hatred was too much to bear. The urge to kill him was insurmountable. In the darkness of my mind, I longed for a way to defeat him. Hundreds and thousands of times, I simulated our battle. And then, it bloomed on me. The flowers of death. Within the darkness, there it was. A beautiful path of blood-red licorice. I must walk along this flower bed. That will reveal a way to kill him. In short, I experienced an enlightenment. And that was how the art of decay was born. An instantaneous two-strike technique. For as long as he thinks that is all it is, he'll never prevail. The technique exists to take down Kagero. It is also the proof that I'm the one and only. In our next battle, I unleashed the technique with all my might, hatred, and intention to kill. Each and every bit of my energy was focused on striking him down. And I must say, I enjoyed myself. For the first time ever, he lost his composure. I could feel the intent to kill and taste the desperation in him. I've never seen anything like it. It was completely outside my expectations. I was going to snatch his life, and he was going to snatch mine. In the end, we both fell. I've had wins, and I've had losses. But this was the first for a draw. And then, you see, something fantastic occurred. What's this? Have I gained my own form? What bliss! Now, we can truly kill each other once and for all! Or so, I thought. A part of it is my fault, but he lost his memories. He's lost himself. I would feel no joy in cutting him down at this moment. I wish to kill him even if there isn't a point, but I can wait a little for the fruit to ripen. Kagero, you're an impediment, a hindrance. I'm myself. A single blade is what I am. That's how it should be. And here, a suitable battlefield for our duel. A blade is like water. It flows cold and feeds the flowers of blood. You who would reject that do not deserve to be a sword. So be gone. Disappear. I'll erase you. My long-sought wish will finally be realized. You have no idea how long I've been waiting for this day. Kagero, I will kill you. He should be arriving any time now. Come, Kagero. You fool. <laughs> what a boring age the world has fallen into. Left with nothing but these tiny, pathetic skirmishes. Are there no war fields or battlefronts? Yes. 
you're that savage they're talking about! How could you do such a thing? What the hell is it you want? I want to battle to the death with him. I want to take his head off his neck and prove that I'm the real one. What the hell are you talking about? A trail of corpses. That is how he'll know my location. Just follow the scent of blood. Plus, he is a complete fool. He won't act unless circumstances demand it. Like stopping someone from being killed. That kind of nonsense. He needs to be backed into a corner, so that there is no place to escape but the battlefield. What a fool. We were created for battle. That is the sole reason for our existence. Enough! I can't take this anymore! I will have my revenge! A grand statement, but turning them into reality is another matter. Shut your mouth! Nothing is more boring than cutting the weak, but you know what? Flowers of blood are beautiful nonetheless. <sighs> How much longer until I get a taste of this with him, I wonder? <laughs> Even I'm still not used to this face yet. be perhaps someone the same kind as me? You there, what are you doing? All oh, right. I almost forgot. Why are you here, all alone and forlorn? This is a dead end. Oh? Are you inebriated? Your name is... What was it again? Hmm. Have we met before? Oddly, not a single scratch on you if we did. But no matter. <laughs> my, my. So there are still some embers burning in you. Exactly what I had hoped. No matter how many times the cycle repeats, you do not change one bit. Of course. I am and can only be myself. I approve. What a coincidence. I do too. You're quite interesting, I must say. Allow me to test you out. <laughs> you are welcome to try. Sliding through your flesh. It is fantastic. 
This marks the end! And this concludes the fight. Splendid. You truly are a strange one. You are so very much weak. <clears throat> so why then do you smell of blood? Once the stain is set in, it cannot be removed. You're hiding your true strength. You have but one life. You should give more thought to how you use it. Now is not the time to be holding back. I remember now. Your name is Kikage. My, where did you hear that name? We have battled to the death many times before. I had learned your name then. Why, I have no memory of that. As for what you are, I do not recall. Or perhaps I never knew. I am myself. A single blade is what I am. If you don't feel like fighting for real, that's fine. I've taken a liking to that scent of yours, so I'm feeling generous. What's your name? I'll put it on your gravestone. Alozard. A lovely name it is. I'll make sure your death is just as exquisite. Ah, oh, right. A blade. My sword will guide you through the veil onto the red thoral path. Behold, art of decay. Was magnificent. Beautiful. You blossomed beautifully. I must say, you were really something. You were the first to meet gazes with me before my strikes landed. Fascinating. Truly fascinating. I shall engrave your name here. It was a pleasure. Now, that fool Kagero... It is about time he reaches me with a strength and resolve. <sighs> this is... I'm sorry he did this to you. Horizontal lines carved into their back and chest. And that's not all. 
I even saw bodies missing their arm. Their arm? Indeed. Left or right. But always one arm. It is all coming together. I see the secret behind his technique, Art of Decay. <laughs> Alizard, it is thanks to you that I am now prepared. I will slay him without fail. May you rest in peace. Finally, you finally made it. I've kept you waiting. I'm here to take you down. That face of yours is looking finer than before. Perhaps the bait I scattered around worked. Bait? You would call life bait? I would indeed. I get to enjoy the pleasure of killing and witness you sharpened by the sight of corpses. Two for the price of one, right? That's the thing about life. It exists to be snatched away. Nothing else could explain these fantastic circumstances around here. I've remembered a little about what you are and about what I am. Oh? I've stopped you and your cruelties. I've thought you must be slayed. I am your enemy. You could not be more wrong in what you are doing. Life deserves to be respected. <laughs> Tell me just one thing. Why do you wish to challenge me so badly? Allow me to correct your words. You cannot kill me. There will be no challenge taking place. <laughs> You're asking why, but isn't it obvious? <laughs> Let's talk about you instead. How's that memory of yours? Have you recalled much? Memories of my past remain blurred. A pity, though I'm probably the one that took them. What do you mean? It means exactly what it sounds like. I understand now. You're just an indiscriminate murderer. <laughs> the very same could be said about you. There is just one thing that I do not understand about you. You have great skill at your disposal. Why not use it for justice? What now? Part of decay. Right now, it is a terrible, sinister technique. 
However, if utilized in the right way, it could save lives. Uh, Skikage, why did you fall to the dark side? <laughs> <laughs> you really have no idea. Why did you fall to the dark side? I didn't fall. I am the dark side. Safe lives. What a joke. An utterly laughable joke. You understand nothing. Nothing at all. Part of the case severs lives, not saves them. The blade exists to split you and I apart. I do not understand the meaning of your words. Well, then I'll spell it out for you, Kagero. <laughs> Listen closely. You are me! you saying? You still can't figure it out? How many times do I need to repeat myself? You are me! That is precisely what I do not understand. Wrong again, fool. You're just refusing to accept the truth. You and I were spirits who dwell in swords. Vengeful souls that have no form of our own. A single sword held us both. I inhabited the blade, and you the sheath. <sighs> we were two souls sharing one body. But I don't need, nor do I want anyone else around. No, that cannot be. You can turn away from the truth, but it will still be there. We fought over and over. All the battles we had in the spirit world. Whichever of us won would gain control of our body. And I hate it when you were the victor. One day, I could no longer stand it. So we dueled to the death. It ended with us both destroying each other, and we split apart. Now, there are two of us. Blade and Sheath as two separate entities. I receive this body. This face, I had to learn how to move and walk again. But the body you have is the original. Flies! None of this can be true! <laughs> your head is as rigid as your moves! A fool even amongst fools! Listen well. Why do you believe your sword cannot be used to kill? Because you're the sheath. Why does your body reek of blood? Because I've killed using that very same body. No, these hands have never killed anyone. Are you so sure about that? Perhaps your mind is forgotten, but I bet your body can recall every last slice. Go ahead, recall that sensation. Remember how it felt. It's still there, I know it. In your palms, in your arms. The feel of slicing into someone and terminating their life. I cut the werewolf down as he fled. I killed the dragon nude as he begged. And I turned my back on the yokai. But that... that cannot be. I... with these hands... With those very hands... You spilled an ocean of blood.
Now that's a face worth remembering. How delightful. I... I have killed with these hands. With those very hands. Now do you finally understand? We're the same, you and I. We're both brutal, indiscriminate killers. But being the same is so very boring. Loathsome, in fact. I... Does this pain you to realize? Does it make you feel bitter? I just... But the pain you feel is nothing compared to my hatred towards you. Do you know how agitating it was not being able to control my own body? <sighs> Even more detestable was that our skills were split even. That's why we traded victories. When I won, I got control of the body. When you won, the opposite was true. 50-50, as even as could be. That's why I had to develop that technique. With it, I can finally be rid of you and do as I please! <laughs> Art of Decay. It is what sets you and I apart. It is the key to my victory. It is the technique that will extinguish your life. Once you're dead, I can truly be free. <sighs> Prepare yourself, Kagero. I'm going to end you! This body... Huh? This body... I remember now. The sensation of the people I killed. I killed people that fled. People that begged. People who called me a friend. Lives were lost by these hands. And no one was left alive. It fills me with such sorrow. Are you going to start crying? Skikage... What do you intend on doing once you have killed me? Is it not obvious? The same as now. Kill and kill and then kill some more. Eventually, the world will change. Each and every soul will glare and tear at one another. And bring back the exciting age of warfare and bloodshed. <laughs> I see. If so, I have no time for tears. You shall not be the cause of any more suffering. And? What is that supposed to mean? It means exactly what it sounds like. This is a conflict between you and I. No one else needs to be involved. Being hurt by you. Hurting you. They are my burden to bear. <laughs> The sorrow. The misery. I will not let anyone else undergo these feelings. What I do with anyone else doesn't concern you. It certainly does. Even the fact that I have reached you were not the results of my power alone. You've came so far by killing people, severing ties. But I have gone this far through connecting with people. Skigage, let's end this. <laughs> no matter. I was waiting for you to show me some fire in your eyes. I didn't own my skill so that I can kill you at your weakest. I want to best you at your strongest in a fair match. Back when we were still one, a defeat simply meant a short sleep. But this time is different. You won't wake up from this one. Die and forever disappear from my sight, Kagero. Skikage, my other half. We are one, hence why I must stop you. You disgust me. A mere sheath is no sword. A sword never unsheathed is but a stick. A drawn sword is but cold steel, neither good nor evil. 
for your duty forgotten, and the path you walk gone astray. Thus, you must fall! You lack elegance! So detestable, it's almost nostalgic! Indeed. Each strike resonates and reverberates within me. I must kill you! I must stop you! Despicable, but that's what makes the hunt all the more thrilling. Now, the end is nigh, Kagero. Your time in this world ends here! Come, I shall prevail. Thoughtless, reckless, pointless. My sword art represents the sum of my existence. Now, it's time I dyed the world in perfect red. My sword will guide you through the veil onto the red floral path. Behold! Art of Decay! Impossible! How? This can't be! How? Skikage, you said it yourself. That we are one and the same. 
<laughs> Twice I have experienced the technique. There is nothing you can master that I cannot. In addition, they say that dead men tell no tales, but the corpse of one man told me everything I needed to know. The key to your technique is the movement. <sighs> Connecting with people, huh? Art of Decay simultaneously strikes the front and back of your opponent. However, the secret to this technique is not magic, but of exceptional swordplay and footwork. You step towards your opponent at an angle, and then rotate your body with the toes of your extended foot as an axis. You make one strike there to the front, and then another strike to the back as you rotate out. By making two strikes from the side before the victim notices, you can simultaneously cut their abdomen and back in one move. After I puzzled out your secrets, all I needed was to do the same. It is this very body in which you had honed your skills. Meaning, the movements of it are embedded into these muscles, carved into these bones. I shouldn't be surprised. This is your specialty after all. Even when backed into a corner facing certain doom, you still managed to see what you needed to know. Detestable. You've always been that way, for ages upon ages. with you. Trace the same steps. There was only one way to defend against your blows. Follow the same strokes. There was only one way to surpass your technique. Master it myself. equal in strength, but now I've surpassed you. Damn it. I can still hear its echoes in my ears. You melded my technique with Yaido, didn't you? You sheathed and redrew your blade with your slash. I can't believe you did it. At the last possible moment, you overcame your pathetic, passive nature. An original strike of your own. self created will you then prattle on about it being karmic justice i still haven't killed enough haven't slaughtered enough i haven't lived enough we are one sword with two souls as your sins are my sins your techniques are also my techniques 
I shall swear an oath. From here, I will use your powers for the sake of this world. I will not waver from my path, even if I must leave a trail of bodies in my wake. I am the sheath, and I am also the blade. I exist to protect, but also to slay. Farewell, Skikaya. Your technique will be reborn. It shall no longer be known as Art of Decay. May you be cursed, Demon Blade. But rather, as Art of Rejuvenation. The ending of our newest tale is as of yet unwritten. The cycle repeats again and again. Claws and fangs break and shatter before fading into darkness. They strive with all their strength, but cannot defy fate. They stretch forth their hands, but cannot grasp victory. I suppose it can't be helped. The curtains of fate have already fallen on this stage. Pride. Peace. Resolve. Resignation. None of it matters in the end. This play was written to be a tragedy from the start. What a pity. It breaks my heart. <laughs> Just kidding. I left my heart behind forever ago. Anyhow, the cycles continue until fate leads them to the ultimate conclusion. Isn't that right, Nexus? <sighs> It's been quite some time, hasn't it? Guardian of this world, why do you seek endless cycles of death and rebirth? Why do you think? Thou art but a broken vessel, destined to succumb. <laughs> There's no need to get bent out of shape. Why, I am doing all this just for you. Keeper, Nexus. Just for you. <laughs> Do remember that this world is under my control. No one can meddle in it unless I say so. Vessel of stagnation. Know thy fate is destruction. I am a Keeper. I am Nexus of Serenity. I bringeth harmony unto worlds. <laughs> harmony. It's very lovely if I do say so myself. But a tad too much and things will lose their interest. Well then, it's time for me to slumber once again. Next, we'll revisit that nostalgic place. Perhaps this time, the bullet of fate will hit its mark. <laughs>